Right, now let's go to some politics matters now. Jubilee leaders continue to rubbish calls for a referendum by court. Speaking in Wasangishu County, a section of the leaders asked the opposition to wait until the next elections to present their case before the people of Kenya. Mercy Kandia reports from Eldoret. The Jubilee leaders hit out at the opposition coalition code over calls for a referendum saying that their move is likely to plunge the country to anarchy. They termed the opposition's demand as a common narrative that has repeated itself in successive elections. Walituambia katiba sasa na kama si sasa ni sasa hivi. Hawa watu jameni, let them give us a break. Kwa sababu haiwezekani kila wakati tunaongea tuvunje hii to badilishe katiba. And I thought his former Prime Minister Raila Odinga when he went to America akaenda kusoma mwezi tatu I thought in his education part of that was the syllabus. <laughs> huh? I thought he was told karibu hapa lakini siku hile September 11 ilifanyika sisi hapa America tulika hapa moja. Because when he came back he did not match with the country where he went to do that uh, kumbaru. And it is important that people appreciate that as a team we must move a country. Mimi ni shabi kwa mpira, we are Manchester United. Tumeshindu wa kwa miaka mi, kwa mwaka moja uliopita. Lakini tulugundua tabu ya hii kwa refari, tabu ilikuwa coach. Kweli ya maapana. Sasa tukatawa Moyes, tumeleta Van Gaal. Kwa hivyo kama team yako na shindua, apana laumu refari, laumu nani? Laumu coach. Deputy President William Ruto rubbished claims by the opposition that Jubilee government was not all-inclusive in its service delivery. Ruto defended the government's track record, maintaining that they are providing services in line with the constitutional dispensation. Wale watu ambao wanatafuta mambo yao ya kibinafsi. Lazima nipewe hii, lazima nipewe hile, lazima nipatiwe hile. Haya mambo... Haiwezekani ya kwamba kila mtu wapate ile anataka. Lakini inawezekana kila mkenya ahudumiwe na serekali ya Kenya. Awa walisema kwamba ECK walikuwa na shida. Wakatoa wakaweka IBC. Tena wameshindwa, wamekuja tena kusema turekebishi IBC. Ninataka niulize kazi yetu ni kubadilisha maofisi ama kufanya maendeleo kwa watu wetu. Na mimi nataka hawa watu wanauliza referenda, mauliza governors. Tulijaribu hiyo barabara. Well, <laughs> if indeed they want this country to move forward, then they should not use referendum as a means of accessing power. The leaders called on the opposition to respect the current institution. Kod had their Saba Saba rally at Uhuru Park and called for a referendum after ditching the call for a national dialogue. Wame, ato wamekaa wako katika kama wamekaa kama kamili uni excellency. Wakiwana mali nye kundu wanasema apana tulikuwa tunasema devolution. Wakifika mali pengine wanakuwa green. Kwa sababu wanasema sasa tunataka system ya government ikue change, ikue parliamentary. Iyo ndiyo wimbo ambayo ilitokea jana. The leaders were speaking at Wonifa in Ainabkoi constituency, Wasingishu County, during the Sunday service and the launch of the Church Squire album. Masikandia Katie in Ainabkoi, Wasingishu County.